something to take away from this is guys if you are serious about competing I just want you guys to know um, it gets difficult but you know at the end of the day if you can like f see it through it's definitely a re rewarding experience I mean you get so much out of it to know what you're capable of to see what your body can do discipline so much growth and experience from competing I swear um, it truly is um, amazing and I encourage you to at least try it once some people only ever do it once and you know you either love it or you hate it but you still you've done it and I mean like it's just one of those things you want to tick off your list of things to do and it's a rewarding experience and um, I highly recommend if it's your first time to get a coach I mean there's nothing wrong with you trying to do it on your own but getting yourself a coach and a good um, a positive bunch of people around you you know it really makes a difference and I'm so freaking blessed to have Taban muscle body and shape behind my back you know to support me they called me up earlier to be honest because I told them I was feeling a bit down and I got texts I got phone call and um, it really did make put a smile on my face you know um, and it, it's it's kind of hard for me to reach out to people because I've always had this 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 thing where you know reaching out to people can be quite difficult and hard for me and um, asking for help but yeah I mean it just means so much to me that they they gave me a call you know my trainer Tanner my brother he was the um, he's the previous champion of Taban Muscle Body and Shape you know and basically he's been training me up to become the next champ as he likes to say so still the champ but he's passing on the torch to me and man I love you brother you're like you really you know the training that you put me through <laughs> take me to hell man <laughs> love you bro and um, yeah you everybody Dor Doreen my mama Arietti um, coach Michael Phoebe honey Maya, all of you, I love you all, you know, God bless you all, you're all there for me, and yeah, I just really appreciate it, and even my Spartan crew, um, the people I work with, um, you're all amazing, um, this year alone, 2019, has really, really, um, it's been amazing, and every year is amazing, but 2019 is definitely tops it, you know to get back into my rhythm, you know, to get my identity back as a bodybuilder and it's just, I cannot be any more thankful and show my gratitude to the people who I care about most and I'm so thankful to God, you know, um, and to all of you and yeah, I'm going to wrap it there because it feels like if I keep going on, I'm going to keep rambling on and I'll probably end up crying or something and i got to go into the gym, so we're going to leave it at that. I love you all. Thank you. Um, if you haven't already, please like, share and subscribe to the channel and share the video and like the video. I'd really appreciate it. And um, you guys are amazing. And if you've been following my journey up until now or even my videos from the very beginning, you know, it's... I want to wish you guys all the best, you know, I'm doing this for you guys to put out that content, to put a little bit more in-depth information in towards of what I'm doing and I will put more videos out in regards to dieting, to training and whatnot, it's just right now it's very difficult to get that kind of content out um, due to time and it's not that I'm lazy, it's just, it's hard for me to sit down and be able to divulge all this information when I'm going through with preparation for competition you know and having to handle all my priorities at the same time but there will come a time when I am going to be able to do a little bit more for all of you because I want you all to witness and you know get something out of me like all the experience and knowledge that I've got and um, yeah we're going to leave it at that so God bless you all I love you all and peace <laughs> Peace. She's got some nice long hair and you notice she's a bad chick. All the boys there can't help it, it's a habit. Clothes that she